There's nothing more annoying than a leaky faucet, but repairing it is simple. To get started, you'll need the following tools. A flathead screwdriver, Phillips head screwdriver, wrench, and a seat removal tool, which is optional. First, determine the source of the leak. If water is leaking from underneath the handle onto the wall, the stem of whichever handle is leaking needs to be replaced. If water is dripping from the tub spout or shower head, you'll need to determine if it's from the hot or cold side. If your shower has an access panel that allows you to turn off the water, determine which side is leaking by turning off the hot or cold water one at a time. If you do not have an access panel, you'll have to make your best guess based on the temperature of the dripping water. Once you've determined which side is leaking, turn off both the hot and cold water supply or turn off the main water supply to your home, usually found outside near the street. Remove the index cap off the handle to reveal the handle screw. Tip: You may need to loosen the cap with a flathead screwdriver. Loosen the handle screw, then remove the handle. You'll need to set aside the handle, handle screw, and index cap to reinstall at the end of the project. If you have a plastic stem, unscrew the retainer nut and pull out the stem. If you have a brass stem, remove the stem by using a wrench and rotating it counterclockwise until it threads out entirely. If you have a brass stem, take a look at the washer, which is located on the lower end of the stem. If the washer is squeezed flat or has a groove worn in it, a new washer may be all that's necessary to repair the faucet. It is recommended that you replace your faucet seat, if applicable, at this time to ensure a tight seal between the stem, washer, and faucet seat. When replacing the faucet seat, you can remove and replace the seat with an Allen wrench or a seat removal tool. Turn the seat counterclockwise to loosen, clockwise to tighten. Tip: If you cannot remove the faucet seat, then use a faucet reseating tool to even out and smooth the faucet seat to a flat surface to ensure a tight seal. Once you've purchased your new stem, you can install it into your faucet. Replace the plastic stem by placing into the faucet body next to screw on the retainer nut. Depending on the style of the stem, there may be a spring and a rubber seat. If so, the spring goes into the faucet body, wide end first, and then the rubber seat goes on top. If installing a brass stem, turn the stem completely to the open position, then rotate the body of the stem clockwise into the faucet until it threads in entirely and tighten with a wrench. Place the handle over the stem and secure with the handle screw. Replace the index cap. Turn the main water to the house back on and then check for leaks.